Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager here with some Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. When we last left off, we entered Orzammar. This place is gigantic. Let's You're turn in some notes. You're the best I've ever seen. But Thank you. Out there. You're the best wrangler I've ever seen. So many notes. I, I trust Vala. Let's go to the Diamond Quarter. <clears throat> As I was saying at the end of the last video, I'm probably going to side with Balin. Mostly because I think Yue agrees with him more, and it ends up with the opening of Orzammar. And he's the more um, open-minded and less judgmental of the caste system, and more against the caste system and giving castless rights and things, so probably gonna side with him. But let's see how it plays out. I don't know, maybe I'll decide how I want. Hi, Noble. Game, stop lagging. I'm not playing you on the PC. Lord the is you a bad Unless you're actually bad. on the surface. Yes, <laughs> the closer to the surface you are, the higher class you are. Unless you're actually on the surface, then you're nobody. Grey Warden arrives in Orzammar. Most likely to pay respects to the rightful king, Prince Balin. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Will you stop talking about me like I'm not freaking here? Chamber of the Assembly. Oh, that was short. Hi, Vartag. Warden, welcome. It is always a blessing for Orzammar to host your order. I am Vartag Gavor, well, thank you. top advisor to our good Prince Balin. What news do you bring? I almost want it. A part of me almost wishes I was a dwarf for this section. Um, this treaty obliges Orzammar sent to send troops to the ah, surface. Ah, ancient documents indeed. These were signed in the reign of Ithnar Bimo, Paragon and King. That was 16 generations ago. Now the difficulty Damn. is that the treaty only compels our king, and we are sadly lacking one of those right now. So you need a king. But the blight is more important than politics. No one wishes this fight over more than Balin. But while it rages, Orzammar can spare no one to combat what may or may not be a new blight. May or may not? You guys know better than anybody. You've probably seen the Archdemon. Are you implying that Grey Warden wouldn't recognize I a blight? You. But what are we to do? If Balin followed his heart and sent his men to aid you, Haramont would steal his throne. We would defeat the blight and return to find our homeland devastated by an incompetent tyrant. And if you don't fight, your homeland gets destroyed. Perhaps you could prove to Prince Balin your intentions are just. Oh, God. If you show you owe Aramont no fealty, I'm sure Balin would help you. <sighs> Aramont has engaged in a campaign of bribery and coercion to ensure that every house serves him. But if a neutral party, a stranger, were to approach certain key members, perhaps with irrefutable evidence of Haramont's deception. Irrefutable evidence? Irrefutable? Which I you mm -hmm. have. I'm certain my Lord Prince would show his gratitude. God, I wish I, I wish there was some third option to like get some third party elected king. Because these two are just ugh. What kind of evidence? Haramont promised the same portion of his estate to two different deshers, Lady Dace and Lord Helmy. Haramont can't possibly grant it to both of them, but they won't find out until after the vote is cast. I have copies of the promissory notes Haramont gave each of them. Once they see those, they should both reconsider their votes. Um, I'll have to think about Don't this. Don't expect this offer to last. If my prince hears you swore allegiance to his enemy, he won't be so friendly next time. I will be here if you change your mind. Oh, uh, you know what? Screw it, let's get it done. If you want Balin to support Shut you your in face. surface war, you'll have to help him. Excellent. I'll do whatever I, I need to to get this over right with here. so I can Just get you guys to on Lady the surface. Dace and Lord Helmy and show them Haramont is not as honest as he claims. Lady Dace doesn't leave the quarter much, but Lord Helmy's adventurous, likes to spend his time at Tapsters in the Commons. Remember, okay. don't tell them you got these papers from me. You learned of them and drew your own conclusions. This is sketch. I'm not sure how much I like this, but we're gonna do it anyway. <sighs> Cause sometimes, even when you're goody two shoes, you need to do some things that you don't like. You need to get your hands dirty in order to save the world. There's a person. 
Hi. I heard there was a Grey Warden here. I am Doolin Forender, second to Lord Harrowmont, King Endrin's own choice as successor. Word is spreading okay. that the surface may suffer a blight. It is shameful we are not in a better position to help. I have a treaty obliging, obliging Orzammar to aid that against may the blight. Be. And that is a terrible risk for the surface. But even if the world would end tomorrow, Lord Harrowmont cannot ignore Balin today. He cannot afford to trust anyone of unproven loyalties. Uh -huh. What do you want me to do? Denounce... Vartag wants me to besmirch Harrowmont's reputation. I see. Well, it hardly increases my confidence to hear that you went to him first. I oh, assume shut you your refused. Face. I'm working for Balin, just wanted to warn you. I'm looking for if a better you want offer. want Lord Harrowmont's assistance, first you'll have to prove he can trust you. How can I prove I'm not working for Balin? That's a generous offer. If you mean it, you might attend the proving today. The Deshers take it very seriously. And unfortunately, Balin found some way to blackmail or intimidate House Harrowmont's best fighters into stepping down. So you'd like me to enter the Proving in Harriman's name? It would name. certainly make your loyalties loud and clear. Balin would never work with anyone who humiliated him in that way. Harriman would have no fear of meeting with you then. I don't want to start picking sides. But I'm afraid sides. your only choice is to wait until there's a winner. Lord Harriman cannot risk his life working with someone of unproven loyalties. If you change your mind, <gasps> the Proving is this afternoon, and Lord Harriman could certainly use you on his side. Okay, so we've got some decisions to make. We will make these decisions eventually, when I have to. First, we're going to be looking into some other things because, uh, yeah, we've got a lot of stuff that needs doing. Thief! Who are you, Warden? I'm outraged. A thief in the Shapred. What have we been reduced to? Um, did you good look? Did. Good looking? He was bald, with the most garish brand across his head. Almost like he took pride in being castless. Imagine! Ah, he's probably in the slum somewhere. As if he'd find a buyer for a stolen tome in Dust Town. They couldn't know the value. Thief in a house of learning, okay. And who are you, Orta? Oh, um, pardon me. Were you looking for a particular volume? Not that I could really help. I, um... I don't know the libraries very well. I'm just doing some research. What kind of research? I was looking for something about the Orton Taig. It was lost during the last blight, and there aren't many records left. They were a noble house once, descended from the Paragon Orton, who composed the grand epic of the Seven Brothers and the Ortonic Symphony. My mother's family believes they were descended from Kalana Orton, who was training in Orzammar when the Taig fell. I'm even named okay. for the house, Orta. Unfortunately, any records would be buried in the Tig's ruins, somewhere in the deep So now roads. you want someone to go get them, huh? I'm a Grey Warden. I'm not afraid of the deep a roads. A Grey Warden? Mother always said that if anyone could find the Tig, it was the Wardens. I hear Prince Balin and Lord Harrimont have both been sending out small teams these days. Yes, if you can find the Tig in any records, that could do it. That could prove I'm a noble. If you could, maybe now that you're looking, it's almost too much to hope. Oh, honey. We'll find the records for you. Don't worry about it. Shaper! When I last walked this hall, Endrin was king and Orzammar was at peace. The memories often speak of the swiftness with which change overtakes us. But it is different to see it firsthand. I apologize, Warden. I should not burden a stranger with such thoughts. I am Zebor. You have a really nice beard. I want it. Um, how do you know the who Grey I am? Warden's visit has been recorded in the memories, along with all who accompany you. Oh dear. Um, I'd like your permission to open a chantry here. That is an odd request, especially for one so new to our city. Um, I come on behalf of Brother Burkle, Clerk of I thought so. This is not the first time he's made this plea. My answer to Brother Burkle hasn't changed. So I ask you the same. On what basis would you have me insult the ancestors and overturn 2,000 years of tradition? Um, the 
Chantry's charities can greatly aid Orzammar. What harm would it do to let him preach? Would you rather wait for a human army to convert you? Wow. Um, the Chantry's charities would greatly aid Orzammar. What Orzumar. sort of charities do you mean? Um, let's see here. Care for widows and orphans. Traditionally, that is their extended family's responsibility, but sometimes Shit. people fall through the cracks. Very she well. He say. may hold a prayer meeting as he requested. If not, Yay. build a new temple to his god. Yay. At least the words would come from one of our own. Now, is yeah. there anything more? <laughs> um, could you look at these promissory papers for me? These are Harrowmont lands promised here. But these are not the deals we approved at the Shaperit. Where did you get these? Um, that is not important. Whom are you protecting? It is a crime against the Shaperit to falsify legal documents. The papers are forged? Not entirely. There were two promised deals, but their terms differed significantly from what is presented here. It appears the scripter mm -hmm. altered the dates and locations of the agreements to make them identical. Um, thank you, I need to have words with You someone. are an outsider, Warden, but not outside the law. I hope you will not do anything to challenge the stability of Orzammar. Hmm. I'm starting to think that I might want to go with Harrowmont. But, oh, it's an- it's an- Guys, it's an evil and an evil and a good and a good. On one hand, Balin's more open to opening up Orzammar and giving rights to the castless. And all that jazz. And, like, going ahead in the world and... Increasing trade between Orzammar and the surface. But Harrowmont's more with keeping the status quo, closing off Orzammar, and keeping the, uh... Oh god, this is a hard decision to make, guys! I'm not sure what I should do! I wonder why they decided to build a city around streams of lava. It's an accident because they're happen. intelligent. <laughs> That's why. Royal Palace. Lord Harrowmont is a... Uh, weak man, and he will be a weak king. Yes. Really? I don't think that's how. I don't think you're very good at your job, dude. Hi, who are you? Oh, you're Lady Dace. Uh, uh, I need to make a decision. I don't want to make a decision. I need to make a decision. I don't want to make a decision. <laughs> Okay, let's weigh the pros and cons. Balin. Somewhat of a tyrant. Very, um, caught in his ways. Well, not caught in his ways, but, uh... But also open-minded to the surface. Will increase trade and will reduce restrictions on the castless and, like, have actual social mobility for them. Harrowmont. Will keep the status quo. Will close Orzammar off even more from the world. Decrease trade. Mm -mm. But Balin has really sketch practices. Harem on straight laced and good. Uh, 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 fuck it. It's right here. Let's do it. Hi. What do you want? Hi. Oh, I suppose you're the Grey Warden everyone's talking about. Um, yes, it's I'm fascinating. Anyway. The surface has an entire order dedicated to fighting Darkspawn. Down here, that's just what fighting means. But I'm sure it's more difficult on the surface. It must be much harder to find them. Much harder to find them? Ha! Ha ha! Well, this isn't exactly a surface broadsheet. Where did you get these? Never mind. It is true enough. But there's nothing I can do about it. This deal was made on behalf of our entire house. Only my father can revoke it. Where is he? He's leading a deep roads expedition, trying to secure an ancient taig. It's unlikely he'll be back before the election, but perhaps this vote is important enough for you to brave the tunnels to tell him? The Dace family would be in your debt. Fine. He was searching an old Iduken site. He left me with this map, in case his expedition never returned. I'll give you a pass as well. Usually, no one is allowed past the front lines. Good luck. I'm a Grey Warden, they'd let me pass it anyway, or at least they should. Let's see here. Okay, what else do we have to do in Orzammar? Got like 5,000 things to do here. Do be two years do. tomorrow. By all the holy, sodding ancestors, 
How can you people just ignore that? Bronca didn't go alone, Ogren. She took the whole house. Everybody but Hi, you. Hi, Ogren. So just get You're over a future the party member. And drowned yourself already. You know as well as I do, that's how this always ends. You <laughs> think I'm afraid of some cub warrior who's barely off the teach? Ha! <laughs> I'll... You lift a weapon or attack I love a single Ogren. citizen He's awesome. in Orzammar. You stripped your cast in exile. Even you can't have forgotten that. Get out of here before I call a guard. Oh boy. Poor Ogren. We'll deal with him later. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager. In the next video, we're going to be braving the deep roads for the first time, doing something that Yue doesn't find incredibly alright, but it's still maybe better than the alternative. I don't know. I'll see you all in the next video.